What's up, everybody? <gasps> it's your boy, Ooch. And I'm back again. Once again, how y'all doing today? What's going on, fellas? It's your boy, Ooch. Of course, back again for another Dragon Ball Super Manga reaction. If I sound a little off, it's because I'm actually just re uh, recovering off of being sick. Don't know if it's the vid, but I obviously did get tested just to be safe. But I am feeling a lot better, and that's why I'm here now to give you guys this reaction. So sorry if it's a little late or delayed in comparison to like you know when everyone dropped their reactions and whatnot out there but finally got the time to do it and uh fair warning um just as a little update i will be doing a boruto one as well because now that i'm caught up with boruto in addition to dragon ball super i will add that right back onto the slew of content I just don't know if it'll be up as soon as when Dragon Ball Super is. It might be delayed by a day, but I mean, hey, if you're watching this and you're watching this when they're not like as they're coming out type basis, then it's not going to matter for you anyway. So without further ado, let's get right into it. Okay, so this is chapter 81, Goku's Conflict. All right, so this brand new, <laughs> this brand new gas, he's out here. What'd he do? Oh my God, did he just put gravity on them? He just, Goku just said his body feels heavy. Vegeta goes, damn it, he's hit us with some sort of spell. This is bad, we need to keep it together or we'll be crushed by his sheer power. End them. Oh. And then Granola tries to challenge Elik. I won't stand for what you've done. But Gas stopped him, it looked like. Did he just like teleport him? Oh, wow. So he teleported Elik. Um, off site to like another mountaintop. So Granola completely missed. Elix says, didn't anyone teach you not to throw punches at your employer? That's just bad manners. <laughs> you murdered my mother. Let's get one thing straight. I decided to let you live, Granola. So when Granola goes and not just my mother, if not for you, nobody on this planet would have had to die. Nice pointing the fingers at him with his finger gun. Elix says, you've got quite the nasty attitude considering you owe me your life. You realize we could have killed you at any point, right? Even right now. Oh! Yo! Okay, I gotta show y'all this one. This one's actually OD. Check this out. My man, Granola, straight up got his arm... Like, his wrists are broken. Gas straight up just kicked him straight in the freaking wrist. And they're shattered. There's no... Like, they're... Do you see the, the curvature is bent? It's, it's over for him. It's over for him. No way. Did he just... <gasps> no way. Oh my goodness. This is getting brutal. Gas just shot him in both his eyes. Is he blinded? <gasps> oh my goodness. What is happening? I gotta thank you for all those jobs you did for us. Here, if nothing else, you get to die the same way your mommy did. See a granola and he gets shot right in the back through his abdomen. You gotta be kidding me. Bro, this is this is this is too much. This is too much. Is this is are we still reading Dragon Ball? What's going on here? This is kind of OD. Everybody literally cannot believe what they saw. Now I wonder if this whole wish is gonna play a factor into it because being the strongest in the universe, I mean I mean, that doesn't necessarily mean you're immortal, but I mean, you, you have to question it because it is Dragon Ball. So let's keep reading. That was a long time coming. You don't mind, do you, that I finished him off? I was no longer interested in him, said, uh, said Gas. Uh-oh, Goku getting pissed. He said, how could they? And my body still won't move, right? Whoa, who did, what happened? Whoa, did, what? Did Vegeta just blast Goku to like snap him out of the spell? Hang on, Vegeta, what was that? The last of my energy. <sighs> Not this again. Oh my god, use it wisely. Are you sure about that? Better that than us dying here. You can still fight. So do something about that scumbag. No words. Elik, I felt conflicted earlier, but in the end, it was indeed necessary that I become the universe's greatest warrior. I am grateful that you made the wish. Hey, enough of that. I'd do anything for my dear little brother. Besides, your job doesn't end here. We can't afford to waste any more time, so just kill him already. Very well. So Goku goes Super Saiyan Blue, charges directly at, at gas. 
Goes for a kick. Gas. Uh, looks like he avoids it. Just barely, though. Gas says, you broke free of my spell, I see. Good on you. Oh, but see? Now Goku's trying to practice staying cool. I actually... That much I do like. In one shot... You see him like angry, like he's trying, like he's like pissed off naturally because they just freaking killed Granola in front of him. And then he like takes a deep breath. That's actually, that's, that's pretty good because that's probably going to tie into the whole Ultra Instinct. I've got no real reason to fight you. So could you just leave this planet already? Calm and collected, are we? No rage over the death of your friend? Goku says, oh, I'm mad. But anger is an emotion that messes with my special move. I understand. Oh, he said, I don't understand. Now that you know our plan, we can't let you live. Begging for your life won't save you, Saiyan. You heard him. Damn, so he, he summoned a oh, spike wall. And he was about to drop on, drop it on his head. Goku just barely got out of the way. Dude, I'm telling you right now, I need them to either make Gas a playable character in Dragon Ball Fighters, or they just need to make a whole new fighting game so that Gas is in there. The way that he creates weapons, he can create like matter that our web ends up being weapons and stuff and he may had a spike wall from the top and then he made a bed coming in to try to crush goku goku, goku just barely stopping it though he gets out of it and he's just trying to throw all these spike walls at him now goku's just playing dodge spike using using one to destroy another okay and then now gas notices a nearby town it looks Hmm, it looks abandoned and he takes some of the, the the buildings and he's like now tossing them at goku like what the heck this is actually crazy goku's just playing a, a ducking and dodge game right now <laughs> Yo. goku literally gets hit by a train son cannot make this up first time for everything i feel like toriyama and toyotaro just recently saw spider-man no way home they had to throw a train in there somehow <laughs> shout outs to spider-man right that's kind of what it seems like anyway gas can send super huge things flying now love it goku flips over it so now they're fighting on a train they definitely just saw spider-man over there in japan they had to have thank you for humoring me with my toys and tools i wanted to test my power i wasn't expecting this to kill you well go on show me the extent of your strength as the son of that vexing saiyan so the funny thing is right gas is also fulfilling another trope within dragon ball where the villain or whoever they're fighting up against is so confident in their own ability that they're allowing their foe or their adversary to bring out the best in them which is super tropey but i digress goku uh, is still trying to land any kind of blow to granola or sorry gas but gas is uh dodging literally everything that he's throwing at him every punch every kick gas gets a nice mid-section punch ooh, right through the gut goku gets hit sucks it in goku still tries to attack him gas oh he got him in a chokehold by by the hand i see not even a hint of fire in your eyes why Okay, Goku manages to toss. So, you know, this guy is being held up in a chokehold right now. Like, he's about to get choke slammed. Somehow, Goku took his wrist and flipped gas over him. I don't know how that works, but he did it. <laughs> so then now he's trying to... Oh, he... Wow. Okay, so Goku looked like he was about to try to hit him with, like, a one-handed key blast. But it looked like Gas just summoned another train or something. And he had it ram Goku. That's insane. What does this fool think he's doing? Says Vegeta. When it, ca when it came down to combat, your father's fierce resolve was like no other. I do not sense that from you. Do you tell me, Bardock... Bardock has something in the tank that Goku did not. And Goku's in a Super Saiyan Blue state right now, so interesting. Let's uh, not forget that part. So Goku's still charging at gas. Gas is just dodging everything. Damn, yo, he questioned him. He said, are you truly his son? Goku said, I hit my head when I was little and lost all my memories up to that point. So I don't remember a thing about my dad or the other Saiyans. 
Then Gas says, that explains it. You cannot comprehend who you really are then. I can never fall to one such as you. Oh, oh my God. Gas is OD with the with the freaking lines right now. This dialogue. He sends Goku's train plummeting into the depths of their of the of a sea right there that they're fighting over over. What? Dude. Goku is now being choked. He's being force choked underwater. I gotta show you all this. This is actually kind of crazy. Look at this. Right over here, he is being force choked underwater. It's bad enough you're already getting force choked, but you're not underwater. Talk about insult to injury. That's kind of OD. The inability to breathe causes you pain. What a fragile, spe what, a, what a frail species. How about I suffocate you then? What a pathetic death that would be. All right, so here we go. Goku starting to struggle. He's fighting. He tries to stick his hand out the water that he's trapped in. Gas goes, hmm, not a fan of that idea, I see. It would not satisfy me either. Okay, so Goku, no way. Goku literally, when he has his hand out the water, he sends a key blast, but it looked like Gas catches it and he sends it right back at Goku. This is ridiculous. Holy crap. A huge splash of water. Elick looks on, looks a little concerned though. Hmm. Why do you have to aim that splash zone our way? Jeez. Goku goes, darn it. How can I beat this guy? And then Goku looks surprised. Gas says, I see now. That explains how you people keep recovering after enough time has passed. Oh, look at that. Manito. I won't allow it. Another soul to die. Not on my watch. He's really trying to revive uh, Granola right now on the side. So Granola is not dead after all. Well, that's crazy because remember, Manito already pointed out that he was not much of a healer type. So now he's really trying to bring back Granola of all people, which is which makes sense. Gret Gas says Manito possesses the ability to heal. He should be the first to die then. Oh, so he's going to he he. Oh no, he's gonna try to go for Manito. Is Goku gonna make it in time? Goku barely makes it in time. Grabs Gas from the back. What do you hope to achieve? Instant transmissions them away. Manito is safe. Oh my God, where's he taking them? So they're definitely on another planet. Oh, shout outs to my man, uh, Jacko. Where I guess at Jacko's planet, maybe? Are there any problems around here? A super elite like me was born to help. You mind changing that light bulb there? My back's been acting up. Do you think I'm some sort of handyman? Fine, I'll do it as a special favor, but only this once. So Jackal's out here is changing light bulbs for people. Yeah, I wonder what planet they're on right now. So now Goku and Gas are literally off on some other planet where Jacko is at. Jacko's like, uh, is that you, Goku? You bet, Jacko. And I'm real glad you were on a nearby planet. Where are we, says Gas. Hmm, heck if I know. What can I say? Is that you'd never be able to make it here with your version of instant teleportation. Gas says, hmm, you still believe a technique of yours is superior to my own? Sure do. I've been using that move for years and years, and it's not a simple one to mast. Oh yeah, look, Goku's proving it too. So, Gas tried to hit him with the instant transmission punch. Goku got out the way mad quick. But Gas still able to get a hit on him though. But yeah, he's, he's still able to lock in on Goku. Goku says, can you really follow me wherever I go? Gas says, don't underestimate my power. Sheesh, that idiot already found another nasty bad guy to fight, says Jacko. I'm gonna pretend I didn't see anything. Yo, Jacko is the laziest Galactic Patrol person we've ever seen. Isn't that right? All right, well, that's the chapter. Um, overall, I did think it was pretty uh, pretty dope, not gonna lie. A lot of action-packed uh, panels, and uh, it seemed like we did get a, a few bits of information out of that as far as, like, the comparing the fight with Bardock that he had. I'm talking about Gas here against Goku. And it does seem like Granola will inevitably be the one to finish this fight off. I anticipate there to be at least two more chapters before the, the actual climax of this entire arc because the movie is coming out very soon, which I actually will be doing a video on that sooner than later and we will definitely be talking about it on the next upcoming episode of full power podcast so stay tuned for that as well as you know our full on review of the chapter entirely which uh you'll hear some other opinions not uh just my own but from the other um co-hosts as well but overall my immediately uh, my immediate thoughts on this chapter is that gas is ridiculous he's 
like very 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 strong he's able to take goku no problem i don't like the fact that we got another situation that is very similar to what we're already used to in that here is goku and vegeta and here is goku getting the last of his life energy or the last of his energy to then make the attempt to you know be the one to defeat their current antagonist as far as the next chapter goes my predictions are as simple as this pretty sure granola is gonna get healed and i'm pretty sure he's still gonna be the one to defeat gas as i said my hope is that they still share some dialogue where gas kind of brings out more of a conversation in relation to bardock and i feel like goku may now have some sort of a cur curious point to wonder more about his dad and saiyans because they're revisiting the the fact that goku you know fell on his head and forgot about literally everybody including his dad and his mom and whatnot now, he has no memory of it i wonder if now after this encounter he's gonna go come from this and be like hey i want to know more about my past and my family and that'd be a really big developing point for goku because he really hasn't developed all that much as a character characteristically you know obviously he's evolved as a fighter a martial artist someone that is constantly just trying to get stronger so that he could go up against stronger opponents and whatnot like his his glass ceiling is never ending that much he obviously grows but as far as character wise i feel like that would be the biggest leap that we've ever seen goku take is to have any kind of curiosity towards his past which is would be the first after all these years of having dragon ball around that'd actually be pretty a pretty big deal and that'll open up a lot of other things and a lot of other theories that i've actually had in the past which i'll save for another video or another podcast episode so look forward to that tell me about your thoughts on the chapter don't forget i will be having a borto manga reaction as well and uh i'm gonna be going back to doing a lot more coverage as far as like mcu related things go just because i really do need to get more content here on this channel i know that it is very dry as far as only having the full power podcast episodes and then whenever these monthly manga issues do come out i am going to be changing up this channel overall it's gonna probably have a few different looks to it but fear not i don't have any intention of ever stopping putting content on this channel but some of the content that you will see might be a little bit different from what some of you guys that are still around are used to i'm hoping that y'all do stick around and stay tuned and definitely check me out over on my video game channel as well as my twitch because that's where i am spending a lot of time as far as you know any of the free time that i do get nowadays please stay tuned to all of that and more join my discord all those links and the supporting links are going to be in the description as always make sure you guys are taking care of yourselves may the power protect keep it locked later right here on this channel stay safe stay clean and stay inside i'll see you guys next time